Hi everyone, I'm Amy with Eating Healthy, Spending Less, and today I'm going to show you why I love the Recollections Planner and why you should get one too. So it's Christmas time and this is the time of year where you want to start thinking about what planner you want to use for next year. There are so many planners on the market, but there's one in particular that's my favorite and it's the Recollections brand planner that you can get at Michael's Craft Store right now. <laughs> There are several things that I love about this planner, but the number one reason why I love it is right here. It's a vertical planner. There's not very many of these that I've noticed, and the ones that are like this are really expensive. But these always go on sale around Black Friday and then the month of December, where you can get them for at least 50% off, if not more. So let me show you why I love this planner so much. Okay, so these are both Recollections planners. This was my Recollection planner from this last year, 2020, and this is mine for 2021. This is the medium size. They also have a smaller size one, and then this is the large size. Now, as you can see, I have upgraded <laughs> to the larger size because I really need more room, and I'll show you that in a minute. So when you open up the planner, you're going to see how beautiful it is, and you can mark it however you want. It's going to give you a let me turn the camera. It's going to give you a year's view so that you can look at the year in a whole. And then you're going to have a ton of stickers. I love these, but honestly, I don't use them as much as I thought I would. Uh, I tend to just write in my planner. Um, aren't those cute? Uh, with a pencil so that I can cross things off or erase it. And then I love this folder that it has, and I do utilize this for certain um, flyers for school or for bills that I need to pay attention to. And then when you open up the planner, you're going to get a monthly view for each month, and then the best part is the weekly view. So I had this in my planner as well, and um, as you can see, I had, let's see, this is how I normally use it, there we go, where you can see my, um, my daily use of this planner. So what I wanted to show you though is how I utilize this planner to meal plan. Okay, so what I wanted to show you here is there are three sections in the planner. Whether you get the medium size, the small size, or the large size, they're all going to have these three blocked portions only in the vertical planner. So what I like to do is I like to put morning and then anything that I need to get done in the morning, my noon or afternoon, all goes right here and then dinner is down here at the bottom so as you can see each week I always write in dinner and then I like to add in what we're going to have each night for dinner this is where I meal plan for the entire week and then up above I don't normally meal plan for breakfast and lunch you could if you wanted to but this is where I put in my daily schedule of things that I need to get done each day and then at the end of the day I put a slash through it so that I know that it's done this to me is just so key. It keeps me living intentionally and I feel more purposeful when I plan out my days like this. And I find that um, I feel much more accomplished at the end of the day when I know that I've completed everything that I wanted to complete and I followed my meal plan. Now, when I do meal plan, I tend to write in pencil so that I can erase and move things around. So actually last night, we did not have stuffed shells for dinner. Uh, and as you can see, this is, not, this is not the week that I'm working in. This is, I'm using this as an example. <laughs> um, but we did not have stuffed shells last night. We ended up having um, some leftovers in the fridge. So I'm going to bump this actually to today and we're going to have stuffed shells stuffed shells today, and then I'll bump taco salad to tomorrow. So that's what I like about this. I write in pencil, I can move things around when I need to. Okay, so when you are looking for the right planner, 
you definitely want to look for the sticker that says vertical planner. You're going to see Recollections has several different types of planners. They have ones for wellness, um, that's like mindfulness, making sure that you're not dealing with stress or anxiety. They have faith-based ones. They have a budgeting binder. Um, I tend to not use the budgeting binder because I, as you've seen in my last previous video about how I budget, I love to just budget in a simple notebook. So if you want to learn how to I budget, you can watch that video. I'll put a link right here for you. Uh, they also have um, goal setting planners. Instead of a vertical planner, they have a horizontal planner. But my favorite, friends, is the vertical strictly because I can break up my days into three sections. It's so easy to meal plan and it's just straightforward and simple. These, this large style retails for $40. Um, that's still cheaper than a lot of the planners that have the vertical uh, style. But during Black Friday and during the month of December, you will be able to see these for 50% off. Uh, so yes, I paid $20 for this. Now, at, if you use Rakuten, you can get this week 10% off your purchase online at Michael's Craft Store. So anytime something is on sale, you can't use that 20% off coupon because that is strictly for a regular priced item. But if you would like to have an additional savings, you can purchase these online. If they are still in stock, they do go fast and use the 10% cash back offer through Rakuten. And I will put a link for that in the description box below. Okay, I hope that that helps you decide which planner is best for you. And I absolutely love this planner and I have been using it. This is my fourth year now. There's no going back. Once you find something that works for you, stick to it. Okay, I hope that that helps you and I will catch you in the next video. Please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out and hit that subscribe button. See ya. <laughs>